brothers and sisters in Christ. Today's devotion is taken from The Desire of Ages by Ellen G. White, chapter 32, page 315. The centurion's servant had been stricken with palsy and lay at the point of death. Among the Romans, the servants were slaves, bought and sold in the marketplaces and treated with abuse and cruelty. But the centurion was tenderly attached to his servant and greatly desired his recovery. He believed that Jesus could heal him. He had not seen the Saviour, but the reports he heard had inspired him with faith. Notwithstanding the formalism of the Jews, this Roman was convinced that their religion was superior to his own. Already he had broken through the barriers of national prejudice and hatred that separated the conquerors from the conquered people. He had manifested respect for the service of God and had shown kindness to the Jews as his worshippers. In the teaching of Christ, as it had been reported to him, he found that which met the need of the soul. All that was spiritual within him responded to the Saviour's words, but he felt unworthy to come into the presence of Jesus, and he appealed to the Jewish elders to make requests for the healing of his servant. They were acquainted with the great teacher, and would, he thought, know how to approach him so as to win his favor. When you go to Jesus, do you feel your unworthiness? Do you feel your need of him? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, as I come into your presence, help me to see myself as I am. Help me to realize my unworthiness and my need for you. Help me to be willing to humble myself as I seek you. I pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. May you have a grand day ahead of you. Goodbye.